Today we'll be discussing about IT strategy and IT steering committee. What is the difference between these two terms and how ISACA confuses us while using these two terms. We do have two committees, IT strategy committee and IT steering committee. Let us see what are the members of IT strategy committee and steering committee. So IT strategy committee basically consists of board members and specialized non-board members. On the other hand, in steering committee, we do have executive from the organization. We do have CIO and other functionaries, key functionaries as and when required. So what is the role of strategy committee? Basically strategy committee advises the board and senior management on IT strategy. As the name defines, strategy committee basically advises on the strategy part of the IT implementation. While steering committee basically focuses on implementation part of IT. So let us see the responsibility of strategy committee and steering committee. Strategy committee is responsible for advising board to ensure alignment of IT with business objectives. What are the IT risks and what are the organizations exposure to IT risk? It directs the management related to IT strategy and then it ensures what are the contribution of IT to the business. On the other hand, steering committee, responsibilities, implementation as per direction of board, approves project plans and budget, setting priorities and milestones, acquires and assigns appropriate resource, ensure project meets the business requirement and continuous monitoring and ensure efficient use of IT resources. So basically, if you see a steering committee take care of implementation part of the strategy committee. Strategy committee basically advises the board, board approves the same and then in turn asks steering committee to monitor this particular IT strategy implementation. So strategy committee shows the direction while a steering committee actually drives the implementation part of it. So this makes this picture makes the things very very clear. IT strategy advises board on IT strategy. Board of directors takes the decision on the basis of advice of IT strategy committee. So once it's being finalized, then they instruct IT steering committee for implementation part of it. Now IT steering committee are responsible for implementations and monitoring. So this is the basic difference between IT strategy committee and IT steering committee. Let us take one example. Please note, all these questions actually resemble the CISA questions that already being asked. Though they are not the actual similar one, but then they, 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 they do resemble the questions that are actually being asked. So here, question is, who is responsible for monitoring the overall project, direction, cost and schedule for system development project? If you see here, question is with respect to implementation part of IT. So as we already discussed, IT steering committee is responsible for implementation part. Let us take one more example. IT steering committee would most likely perform which of the following function. So here the function of IT steering committee is being asked. If you see placement of purchase, installation of system software, interview staff, these are basically role of IS department or IT department. But monitoring IT prior project prioritization as well the business requirement is the prime responsibility of IT steering committee. So they need to ensure what are the project that IT is carrying out is as per the business requirement. So again here question is with respect to role of the steering committee, IT steering committee. If you see option A, B and D are basic, sorry, option A, C and D are basically routine role of IS or IT department in coordination with user management, while option B is the correct one. So role of steering committee is to monitor the particular project and in case of any uh, hurdles or in case of any problems, they need to escalate the project issues to the top management or to the board. Again, role of steering committee is being asked. 
ensuring installation of genuine software efficient use of it resource vendor assessment advice board on members of the new project now option d is basically role of strategy committee option a and option c are basically role of it department or is department in coordination with user department so basic answer here is option b that is to ensure efficient use of it resources they need to monitor the performance and to ensure it resources are being optimally used it steering committee should review information system primary to access so basic role of it steering committee is to ensure whatever it processes are being carried out from the it department by as basically they support the business requirement so this is the very important role for it steering committee which of following is the function of is steering committee so again role of hiring steer is steering committee so as we know basically approving and monitoring major projects status of is plans and budgets option a b and c are basically routine work to be performed by is department last question which of the following is a major control weakness that can adversely affect a system development project so option a says out of 10 recommendation from it strategy committee board has approved only 8 recommendation now this is not control weakness role of it strategy committee is to advise board now it is up to board either to accept the recommendation or to reject the recommendation so option a will not be valid here option b and c project deadline and project manager not been part of project approval plan though these are critical activity but they are not as critical as option d wherein organization has decided that a project steering committee is not required in exams of project steering committee uh, role of which is to monitor and to implement the projects uh, it's very difficult for the project to grow on so option d is the answer here Thanks for watching please visit datainfosec.blogspot.in for more such videos